Welcome back, everyone, to Slime Rancher! We're back, baby. Oh, two. Two. We're back, baby. Let's uh, see what we want to do today. I have a loose idea. Um, I don't have a ton of time, so today's episode might be a little on the short side. But, let's see. Okay, not really needing that, honestly. Boom plorts. Okay, so one thing I do want to do today is get some boomies. Uh, we found them in the last episode. And also some ringtails. I think... I may want to grab some ringtails and then... We won't want to mix them with the boomies, I don't think. But... Um... We're pretty close to being able to get this. I don't know where wild honey is. We don't really need the thing anyway. This would be kind of nice. We can find some lava dust today. That would be cool. Right, there's also fire plorts somewhere. Well, okay, for today, our main goal, at least, is to show up and act like we don't know nobody. But we also want to get the boomies. That's our main goal. And if we can, maybe also grab some ringtails. We may also just grab a bit of resources. Well, let's see. Who's, uh... Mochi! Oh, God. What voice do they have for her? Hey, B. Those drum... No, that's not what it is. Hey, B. Those drones you've been flying all over the island, there's something weird about them. Hmm? Hey, I got eyes in the sky and I'm gonna use them. I'm also readying a team of drones to head over there and check things out in a more hands-on fashion, but I digress. Anyway, that drone seems super advanced, almost alien. And so I thought, okay, there's some aliens out there checking out Rainbow Island just like you. But no, I don't think so. Because it looks a lot like the drones we use, but so much more familiar to me. Almost like it's giving me deja vu, it's kind of creepy. Hey, don't be scared, it's probably just aliens. Giant three-headed aliens with huge claws that are looking for humans to capture or eat or both. Blah ha <laughs> Later, B. Alright. We also have Thora West. Is she new? I guess she kind of looks familiar. Well, now, if it isn't Beatrix LeBeau, old Hobby and I were just talking about you. Word is, you went off to parts unknown of this here rock with a thirst for adventure. a girl. You just keep on walking to see what new wonders are around the next corner until your boots have holes. And then get yourself some new boots and do it some more. Me, well, my boots have seen better days, but I know there's still an adventure or two left in them. I suppose I just need to figure out what. Ah, oh, heck. I'm just rambling like, just like Hobson does after he gets to talking about exploring. The cosmos, cooking, or uh, pretty much any other topic. All right, B, you hang in there. I'll be calling to check in on you. Doesn't matter who you are, we'll all start feeling it when home is beyond the horizon. Oh, and before I forget, here's a little something for you to spruce up your new place. It ain't much, but you'll need what, but you need to do what you can to make that place feel cozy. A taming bell. Ooh, I don't know what a taming bell is. All right, well we'll look at that when we get back. But for now, I would like to embark. So, yeah, we're going to try to find some ringtails. I think there were some in the uh, the Ember Valley, which is where we got to go for the boom slimes, obviously. Um, but we're going to have to see. I appreciate sure there were some out there, um, but we can only get them, as you remember, at night. Um, because in the day, there's statue things. At least I'm pretty sure we can pick them up at night, hopefully. We do also have all these new slots now, or the one new slot, but we have five total slots now, as well as the water one. So we can, I mean, this is this is huge. We're gonna be able to get all kinds of crap while we're out on the range. There is some jellystone up there, but we already passed by the refinery link, so I'm not gonna worry about that. Hello, my friend. Boop. All right, let's go through, and let's try to kind of truck it towards the boomer area now where was the, oh you know what i should have brought the the stony hens well that's all right we'll do that in another episode we have plenty to do this episode was the boomer area down here or was it this area i 
don't know. I think we're going to try to go to this area, though. Um, either way, it'll be something new, so even if it's not boomies, then I'm sure we will find something. Oh, is it becoming night already? I think it is. We are seeing some phosphos, so... Um, I think it might be already getting to night time. Oh! See? Well, that's alright. I mean, that will give us a chance of finding... Um, ringtails, so that is certainly alright. Oh, there's one right there. Okay, cool. Um, I guess I'm just gonna grab you and take you with us for the time being. Um, I guess hopefully we'll find more somewhere. I guess I will grab some radiant ore while we're out here. I'm not gonna be too attached to it in case we have more important things, but I will grab it when I see it. Um, okay, got some tar, of course. Ooh, okay, some primordial oil. We have a lot of this, so I'm also not going to be too worried about grabbing a ton of that. But with that extra slot, I am feeling confident that we can grab pretty much everything we need. We just still may have to delegate a bit, of course. Um, okay, I think this was the way to the boomer area. It might be right in that cave. I guess, should I bring this guy with us? I'm not sure how close to night it is. Oh, it's 13. Okay, it's only it's only 1 in the afternoon, so it's not even close to night. All right, well, we'll leave him there then for now. We know where 1 is. Hello, buddy. A little hungry. A little bit of a hunger bear. Uh, okay. Fatty rock largos. Is this... Oh, okay, so this is going out here. Huh. I guess we maybe could make it there this way. But you know what? I kind of think I'm just going to turn around and try to find the other entrance. What was that That little ledge up there? Um, I wonder what... Come here, buddy. I want to bring you with me. Was that... Did that also go to the same place? Or... Looks like there might be something up there as well. I try to get up there. But this way, also it's just going to go over there. Yeah, we need to get over there. Okay. That does look like it's the lava area. So I believe we'll try to make it over there. Um, okay, looks like we can go right over there from here. I'm going to grab this. Rao Quackly. I don't actually know what we need Radiant Orb for at this point in time, but I'm sure... Ooh, I could grab an Odd Onion for the crystal boys. What I really want is a mint mango, but I guess those are, yeah, those are gonna be in the uh, the other area, the Starlight Strand. We'll just have to see about them, but all right. Let's keep going. I'm gonna keep this guy with us for now. Uh, so you go into the cave. All right, I'm gonna leave him here. We'll remember where he's at. Um, alright, I guess let's try the cave. Let's see what's up in here. Okay, okay, nothing yet. There's a ledge up there. It does seem like we could get higher up and kind of explore from a high vantage point, which is pretty nice often, so we may want to do that. Hey, boys! Boom slimes! Excellent. I'd probably like to grab six of these bad boys, so let's try to do that. Hey, buddy. They really glow in this version, in the in this sequel. I feel like they glow brighter than they did in the other one. Okay, well, we're already getting pretty full, but like I said, I'm not too attached to this stuff. Oh, is that lava that's going to hurt me? Oh, yes, okay. All right, doesn't seem like it's super dangerous, but we do have to watch out for that. I feel like there may be slimes. Ooh. Pomegranate could be nice. We could mix the baddie slimes with something else. Although mixing them with the phospho slimes does seem to be a good combo. I don't know. We'll think about it. Okay. A big rock. Cool. Let's keep our eye out for lava dust. I don't know what it's going to actually look like in the environment. 
but I guess we'll see. Probably gonna be pretty obvious. I imagine it's kind of gonna be like a little fire geyser or something. Doesn't seem like it's anything to do with it. Is this also gonna hurt me? No, okay. Oh, there we go. This has gotta be lava dust. Okay, cool. Um, what should we get rid of then? I guess I'll get rid of, for now, odd onions just don't, you can't plant them without having it be mostly carrots, so we're just not going to worry about that. But lava dust, awesome. Okay, we definitely need this, so let's hopefully grab as much of that as we can. It seems like there's a decent amount in here. I mean, I don't know where else you're going to be able to find it, so we might just have a ton of it in here. Oh, okay, so this is where the batty gordo is. Interesting. Hi, buddy. Something behind him. Can't quite tell. What is over there? Interesting. Well, okay. We'll be back one day for you. I guess I will try to take the pomegranates back because we can grow them, and that could be nice. Oh, there's a fire slime right there. Uh, okay, let's get rid of the primordial oil now. Yes, okay, a fire slime. That is awesome. Um, yeah, we'll leave the oil... Well, oh, there's a dust I must have missed. Well, we are uh, we are full of stuff now. I will get rid of the radiant ore if we find something a little cooler. I guess we'll see. Well, we know where he is now. Is he on the map? Yes. Okay, good. If we could actually find the map, uh, that would be really great. I haven't seen it yet. I guess let's go this way. What is this way? There's also that outside area. How the hell did a cube berry get in here? Uh, okay. Interesting. Well, I'd like a bit more lava dust if we could find some. At least ten, I think, would be a good place to start. Uh, let's grab the radiant ore while we're here. While we still have it in our inventory. Um... And if we can also get another slot, which is awesome, because in the first game you can't get any more slots. So it's, I'm very glad that they did that. Oh, interesting. I guess... Hmm. All right, let's go back the way we came. Um, I don't think... I think... It, I don't think it would be worth going that way just to find the other side. Oh, if we find a ringtail, though, I'm going to need to get rid of that radiant ore. I guess we don't need ringtails right now, so... I think I'll prioritize them less just to get a good stock of uh, radiant ore going. I think that'll be worth, in the end, a lot of crystal plorts in here. Okay. Okay. Let's move this way. Um, I guess let's see if our ringtail buddy is out here. Now that it is nighttime. Or I guess it's close. Oh, hey, bud. He is here. Fruit, veggie, and meat. Oh, they can eat anything, basically. Well, I'm really tempted, but I don't... I think the rest of this will be better. We'll get ringtails in another ep. Uh, for now, though, let's just focus on the actual lava stuff. Ooh, we got some lava bats. They actually look pretty cool. But it is a little bit of a dangerous area. Um, wow, a lot of lava around here. Would like to not land square in that. Um... Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Uh, okay. I mean, we're going to be fine. These guys aren't really... Uh, oh, shit. Did I just launch a lava dust? Oh, son of a bitch. Where'd it go? Oh, here it is. Okay. We got it. We're all right. Okay. There's a bit more. Very nice. And there's one more right here. Cool beans. Cool beans. Um... Seems like it for this area. There's a geyser over there. Not even totally sure what that's useful for. Um, okay. Not seeing anything more out here, really. There is something up there that I am interested in trying to see. Wow, we're taking a lot of damage here, actually. I'm sure we'll be fine, though, as long as I keep an eye on it. Um... Ooh, okay. Bit more in this direction. 
some more boomies. I would love a couple more fire slimes if we could find those. There's a bit of actual plant life up here. A lot of cute berries. Pog fruit. Um, let's see. Okay. Oh, is this... Where does this go? Ooh. You can never quite tell what's like... You know, something interactable and what's just a decoration. Oh. Oh, that's the other side of the baddie gordo. Okay, interesting. Well, then all that does is give us a an easy path through here. Um, but we don't really need that, I guess. Oh, are those fire slimes? I believe they are. Hey, boys. Hell yeah, we're going to need to make an incinerator on the farm. Because um, they like to live in that. And then they eat ash. So we gotta just keep supplying it. Is that a briar hen? It is. I would probably like those, but I'm not gonna worry about it for now. Uh, but yeah, they eat ash, the fire slimes. So we have to um, burn just anything, really, in the incinerator to get it to make ash, which is what they just they'll consume. But then they'll just give us fire plorts, which we do need for something. I can't remember exactly what it was, but we do need it for something in the fabricator. Get some more lava dust. We're getting quite a lot, so that should hopefully tide us for a while. If we could get 20, that would be sick. Okay, boom, Gordo. Hey, buddy. So you block access to this area. Very interesting. Okay. Well, he's also meat. Uh, they specifically like briar hens. So, oh, are these all? Oh, hey, boys. I don't know how many of you I can actually keep in one incinerator, but we're going to find out. Wow, there's a lot of you guys. I guess that makes sense. I'm going to grab all of you. Uh, maybe we could have a couple incinerators. I don't know. And we have plenty of extra stuff that we could incinerate. Um, okay. All right. Well, I think... Uh, Seems like we've gotten most of the fire area done. Ooh, there is a bit more this way. Ooh. A boomy. Hey, bro. Uh, a couple more geysers. I am interested. It seems like there's a decent amount of stuff around here. There might be more to explore. Oh, there's the map. Awesome. Let's nab this bad boy. There we go. Okay, sweet. Oh, there's even a extra temple area down there that's interesting i guess that's where that other path goes okay well, let's give it a let's give it a look let's give it a quick look see let me go grab this lava dust both of these actually nice yeah this should definitely uh tide us over for a while as far as lava dust goes this is just a fiery episode man everything we're getting is nice and fiery grab you cool Grab. Oh! Oh, wow, there's so many fire slimes here. I definitely can't have all these, but I'm gonna take them anyway. I do like them a lot. They're up there with puddles as being close to my favorites. Um, okay. Little treasure pod. Show me, show me, show me. A magma pool. Hot, relaxing, soak in the magma pool if you're a fire slime. Oh. Huh. Interesting. I wonder if we could actually put fire slimes in there. I guess we probably can. That's actually an interesting one. I am curious as to the functionality of that thing. Because, I mean, maybe you can put fire slimes in there just for safekeeping. Oh! Oh, I see another treasure pod. Okay, I think the easiest way is going to be this way. Huh. This might even be the way we just have to go. A couple more boomers. Definitely have plenty of them, too. But, you know, never have too many. Uh, okay, maybe that's the way we have to go. So let's run and grab the treasure pod over here. Okay. Not really ever anything useful in those, um, unfortunately, but kind of whatever. doesn't really matter. A tall magma clump. Cool, cool. I guess the magma decorations do actually sound kind of cool looking, at least. So I could probably get behind those. Okay... You never know where there's going to be a secret. Oh, we have a, uh, a honey thing. Well, we definitely don't have room for that anymore. So let's just keep moving. K 
keep it schmoovin'. You know how it is. I don't think we're gonna be picking up anything new this episode, or you know, as far uh, after now. Um, wow, lava waterfall is pretty cool. Lava fall, I guess I should say. But I do think we're full on new stuff for now. Um, but let's just keep exploring, explorating. So what's? It kind of feels like we need to go up there. But what's this way? Another treasure pod. Ooh, okay. It does look like we need to go up there. Medium red ashwood. Okay. Getting a lot of radiant ore too, so I am actually glad we started picking that up. Um, okay, let's go. Let's find our way up there. I think this way will do it. There we go. Run along here. Go up here. A lot of verticality in the uh, magma area, I'm noticing. Oh, we do have a drone. Let's see what this guy has to say. I never managed to conclude if the prisma waves caused all this lava to erupt to the surface, but I believe it did. Prisma waves. Interesting. The rainbow grass and iridescent rocks, all lovely to see, and the ecosystem seems to coexist with it to some degree, but this lava, this is the breaking point. My guess is it started like it always does. It creeps up in a few degrees over the years, and you hardly notice it, and then one day you realize you're cooking. Ugh, I wish I had a dog to pet right now. <laughs> okay, well, that's kind of interesting, at least. Um, oh, I missed a radiant ore down there. It seems like this... I don't know. I guess it seems like this is a recent development, and maybe the volcano is important to what like this area has become like it kind of made it this way all rainbowy and everything have we been up here i think we have okay well whoops let's go back and try to get back on our way towards that temple which looks like it's this way yeah yeah okay cool so i i don't know what we're gonna see over here i mean there could potentially be another portal i mean i guess the tabby one we have just figured is a portal, huh? It almost looks like an ice area. Ooh, that would actually be super cool. I'd be super in for, like, an icy area. Maybe that's where the saber slimes are. I saw them in the trailer, or, you know, in the art, I guess. Um, so I know they're in the game somewhere. Last time they were just in, like, the primordial area, but maybe they're in, like, an icy area. Whoa. Is that supposed to look like that? Or is that, like, unfinished? Because it looks like it's fucking man-made. That's crazy. Or is it just, like, unfinished because the game is still early access? I don't know. Well, one day we will see. Okay. Temple. Now, oh, got a creepy little tar boy. Guess I'll kill him. Um, another odd onion. Okay, nothing new or too interesting yet. Oh, there is also more that way. Oh, there, that's the area down there where the angler thing was. You know, the angler plort receptacle. So, that's interesting. It seems like there's more temple maybe down there. But let's look around here first. I feel like this is a good place for another Gordo to be. But we have this for now. There's also not the treasure pod tiers in this version, which is interesting. Golden chicken statue? A golden soaring monument to chicken kind. Wow, okay, well that thing's awesome. We're definitely gonna make one of those eventually. Probably need to use a gold plort to make it, but I mean, I think that's fucking worth it. Okay, so this is striking me as another portal. Wow. Where would this go? Oh yeah, you know, it looks like there's another area down there. Or perhaps gonna be. Wow. Man, this game is so... It really is expansive already. Like, it, this is more than I was expecting to be done by now. Okay, I don't see anything down there. So I don't know how to activate this portal. But there must be some way. I mean, it might not be available to us yet, I guess. It might not even be in the game. But let's see. I'm going to jump around a little bit more. It doesn't seem like there's anything out here. Huh. I mean, maybe there's a, uh, a something or other, um, like a button or something around here. Hmm, I don't know. All right, well, for the interest of time, like I said, I don't have a ton of time today, unfortunately. Uh, let's keep moving. And let's 
I guess, make our way back at this point. Oh, so that's... Okay, okay. I know where we are. Well, cool. Yeah, let's get back. And then we can throw all this stuff in the ranch as our final act. I'm not going to be able to pick up anything else, so I guess I'll kind of just rush through this area. Um, make sure I'm going the right way. Yes. Okay. Well, yeah, this is still a lot of very useful stuff and stuff that we do need. So, it is still a good amount of progress this episode, for sure. Let's keep it shamoving. Okay. Okay. Alright. Good enough, good enough. Yeah, let's get back and... Uh, we can dump our resources, get the fruits growing. I guess we'll have to see about what I actually want to do with the pomegranates. Um, it is so funny. They're just... I mean, the name is literally just pomegranate. But, I mean, it's a fucking... It has granite in the name. Like, I get it. But it's like, I literally am just saying the word pomegranate. Alright, let's dump all of these bad boys in here for the time being. Not that it matters too much, but we might find some jelly stone or whatever on the way back that we want to grab. I'll keep an eye out for it, at least. I do like having that refinery receptacle there. It does give us the space to keep potentially grabbing things. Uh, oh, I'm not going the right way. This way. To keep potentially grabbing things, like, as we're moving. So I do quite like it. Uh, I'm not seeing any... Oh! I guess I will... We do need deep brine, actually, so I will go grab that. Oh! And... Oh! Oh, so this is where the deep brine is next to the boat. I see. Okay. It's not over here on this side. I see. Okay. Alright. Yep. Yeah, let's keep moving. Let's make it back. Hello, home. It is good to see ya. Um, I guess I will really quickly make sure everyone is fed. Grab all of these. These guys get hungry real quick because they're uh, the batty slimes. I'll give them plenty of food. Let's go over and feed these crystal bunnies who look just like their lettuce now, which is awesome. They actually seem like they're pretty full, so I'm going to give them a few and then we'll store the rest for now. I am trying to keep a good storage here. And we already did pop the bunny gordo, so we don't need lettuce. But it can still be useful for future vegetable eaters. Um, you guys also look like you're doing pretty good. Grab out all these. We haven't even seen the rock gordo yet, I don't think. Have we? No, I I'm pretty sure we haven't. It's probably over in the Ember Valley somewhere. But we will have to see. I guess it could also be just in this area. To be honest, uh, I guess I'll store the rest of these as well. Cool. Okay. Uh, let's go throw the deep brine in there. And then I guess. Huh. We're going to need to think about how we want to organize this with the boomers and everything. I think I might mix the boomers with the baddies and then find something else to mix with the phosphos. So let's put the boomers next to... Ooh, do we even have enough corrals for this? Because we're using all of these now, I think. Shit. We might need a new area. Let's see, how much does this area cost? Because we have a little bit of money it might be enough nice okay the archway an expansion to the conservatory set amongst ancient ruins and fields of rainbow grass awesome okay uh we can also sell a bunch more plorts if we need a little extra cash for making everything wow yeah this area is quite nice wow all right how many plorts is this plots one two three four five okay it looks like five cool beans um, okay, let's see. For now, um, let's just set all this up. Uh, I think I might keep these separate and let's just throw these guys both down here. Let's put a corral here. Let's grab some high walls. Um, air net. 
And we'll also buy a solar shield. I think. Well, maybe not for now. Because the baddies don't need it. And we'll get a plur collector. Okay, we are out of money now. So we are going to need to sell some stuff. So let's throw one, two, three, four, five, six in here. Oh, they're so cute. And they really do glow a lot more in this game. And now let's get... Oh, right. We need... Okay. Okay. Well, let's throw these boys out. Sorry, fellas. You were kind of just uh, four extras. Um, let's go... Yeah, let's go sell some stuff. And then we can get everything planted. I guess... How long has this episode been going on for? Okay. About long enough. So I, I will actually... I'm going to handle the rest of the chores and everything off camera. And next episode, we will have the boomer set up and the... Um, I might save the fire slimes to set them up in the episode, but then I'll also get the pomegranates growing. So that'll do it for this episode, guys. I hope you enjoyed. I had a lot of fun, as always. I love this game. And I'll see you guys next time. All right, peace out, jankheads.